Earlier this year, Low Alpine released their rock range, of which the Outcast 44 that we've got here is one of them. It's pitched as being the more sporty end of the spectrum, so you might ask, what are we doing at Millstone? A crag which isn't exactly renowned for its bolts. And the reason being is because actually the Outcast is just fantastic all around her that does a bit of everything. The Outcast has a hinge design, which means that everything's on display, everything is easy to see. There's two compartments, one of which I tend to use for things like ropes and rack and all the spare clothing. The other I tend to use for my soft goods, like my harness, my short bag, my rock boots. As you see, I've got basically a full trad rack in here right now of one half rope. 44 litres, it's quite sizable, big enough for a good day out in the hills or on a more local outcrop like we're on today. If you're sport climbing, there's more than enough room for an 80 metre rope and there's also straps in order to keep it fastened and secure. One of the best things about the Outcast is actually just its simplicity. There's no unnecessary features, there's no faff. Across the front, you've got 840 denier ballistic nylon, which is pretty damn durable. <laughs> On the sides, you've got 420 denier nylon, which is, to be honest, similarly durable. <laughs> It's, it's a pretty bomb-proof pack. The Outcast back system is of particular note because it provides enough support for you to carry actually quite reasonable loads, and it does that courtesy of a sprung steel frame in the back. The final two features are the straps just over the top of the shoulders, which also give you room for rope storage, useful if the rest of the pack's full. And finally, a nice big pocket, which has plenty of room for even the chunkiest of guidebooks. Jungle.